Welcome to Diagon Alley, where you can find all your supplies for the school year. Use your arrow keys to explore the many shops such as Flourish and Blots and the Magical Menagerie. Things are always bustling here in Diagon Alley. Wizards and witches from near and far come to purchase the tools of their trade. If you haven't already, be sure to look in the Apothecaries, as well as Flourish and Blots, which features an ample selection of books and periodicals, and of course publications by Gilderoy Lockhart. Splendid idea. Let's browse the shelves at Flourish and Blots. If you're looking for a copy of Ancient Runes Made Easy or Charm Your Own Cheese, you've certainly come to the right place. So, where to now? Good day. Let's take a look over here. How are you? Flourish and Blots is preparing for a very special event. Professor Lockhart is due to arrive for a book signing of Magical Me. Since you're here early, you could be first in line. Ah, Magical Me is here. But let's go around and take a look at some of his other titles. Aren't these wonderful? You could be one of the lucky ones who takes home a signed copy by the professor himself, if you have a galleon or two. Have you found what you were looking for? Perhaps a copy of 1000 Magical Herbs and Fungi by Philida Spore, or a history of magic by Batilda Bagshot. Or perhaps you'll find what you're looking for over by the front desk. Have you 
taken a good look at all these copies of Magical Me. Well, do come again soon. So, what would you like to explore next? Here at the Magical Menagerie, you can find all sorts of creatures, from the bats hanging off the sign to the chimps and ferrets lining the storefront. Should you be in search of a horned toad, a raven, or a rat tonic, this may be the place to find it. This apothecary has all sorts of herbs and plant life. I wonder if Professor Sprout obtains her mandrakes here. If you're in need of an Abyssinian shrivel fig or leaping toadstools, this would be the apothecary to patronize. Over on the left, there are countless jars of potion ingredients such as dittany, venomous tentacula, asphodel, and fluxweed. Excuse us, please. Why, thank you. This apothecary specializes in potions. Here you will find many things you need to concoct your drafts. Notice the jars and bottles on display. Here are scales and fine tools for precise measurement. To your right are shelves filled with what looks like cleaning solutions, restorative drafts, dragon liver, skelegro, and more. If you can remember the name, you'll probably find it here. Moving further down the alley, you can see Wiseacre's wizarding equipment and scribulous writing instruments. Coming up is Ilop's Owl Emporium, where Hagrid bought Hedwig for Harry's 11th birthday. From here, you can take a closer look at all the wondrous owls at Ilop's, or take a look at the latest gear at Quality Quidditch Supplies. I wonder if they stock a mini Nimbus for that little wizard in the carriage. Above Wiseacres, the traveling wizard can find lodgings to rest their weary bones. There are many fine establishments to make note of in Diagon Alley. Yes, there are many fine instruments at Wiseacre's Wizarding Shop that can aid a wizard in their magical pursuits. Have a look at the display and you'll see all sorts of devices. Here at Ilop's Owl Emporium, you can find a wonderful selection of owls to choose from. 
Barn owls, tawny owls, even snowy owls like Hedwig. Owls are such incredibly intuitive creatures and fiercely loyal as well. Here you can find a fine collection of quaffles, bludgers, and most importantly, golden snitches. Whether you're in the market for a Nimbus brand broomstick or a clean sweep, you can rest assured that quality Quidditch supplies will sell you only the finest. Would you like to go in? Have you seen the latest? The Nimbus 2001. Of course, the Nimbus 2000 is no slouch either. Just look at all the quaffles, bludgers, golden snitches and bludger bats. Everything you could possibly need to become a great Quidditch player. Ah, here is Madame Malkin's robes for all occasions on your right, an ice cream parlor on your left. Moving onward, you'll find Pottage's Cauldron Shop. Marvelous place, Diagon Alley. So much to see and do, as long as you have a few newts in your pocket. Here at Pottage's Cauldron Shop, they have whatever you need. Copper, brass, pewter, silver, self-stirring, collapsible. If you've got a potion, Pottages has the cauldron. And how are you today? Oh, those Sundays look delicious. Now, you don't want to go down there. That's Nocturne Alley, dodgy place, you know. Of course, if you are looking for shrunken heads, gigantic black spiders, or withered hands, there's no better place. And that concludes our tour. I'll leave you now. I'm off to have a little snack at the Leaky Cauldron. <laughs>